Tesla's new $10,955 Model 2 isn't shocking because it's cheap. It's shocking because early data shows it feels engineered like a $40,000 car. A lighter roof that cuts heat, doors that seal like luxury models, quiet glazing, smarter seats, and parts designed to slash lifetime cost. All of it points to one question. Did Tesla just redefine what premium means at the low end? Let's dive right in. Once you step past the headline price, the Model 2 starts revealing a deeper pattern that's impossible to ignore. Nothing on this car feels random. Every design choice hints at a quiet engineering strategy built around one goal, creating a low-cost vehicle that doesn't behave like a low-cost vehicle. And the first clue becomes obvious the moment you look up. Most buyers will see the polycarbonate light roof and assume Tesla cut corners, but a closer look shows the opposite. By replacing heavy panoramic glass with a precisely formed polycarbonate sheet, Tesla removes up to 18 kilograms from the highest point of the car. That shift may sound trivial, yet it subtly changes how the Model 2 moves, turns, and consumes energy. A lighter upper structure lowers the center of gravity, stabilizing the body and reducing the constant torque corrections electric motors must make in city driving. The result is a quiet, steady gain in efficiency that compounds with every trip. And that alone raises a question. Is Tesla saving money or quietly improving the everyday physics of the car in places most people never think to check? Then there's heat. Polycarbonate mixed with proper UV and infrared coatings creates a roof that keeps the cabin up to 6 degrees cooler under harsh sun. A cooler cabin means less work for the air conditioning system, gentler battery drain, and a more comfortable interior before the first mile is even driven. And, as an unexpected bonus, replacing the entire roof, if damaged costs less than many people spend on a weekend vacation. Suddenly, what looked like cost reduction begins to resemble strategic design. And once that pattern appears, it becomes impossible to unsee in the rest of the vehicle. The seats tell the same story. Instead of heavy motorized systems borrowed from luxury sedans, Tesla switches to thin air bladders powered by a microblower. At first glance, that sounds minimalist, but the effect is surprisingly premium. Soft pressure cycles that relieve fatigue, maintain circulation, and keep the driver comfortable far longer than traditional foam seats. The system uses a fraction of the power, eliminating a chunk of weight under the occupants and reducing the number of failure points over the vehicle's lifetime. It's the kind of engineering solution that looks simple only because someone spent a long time refining what didn't need to be complicated. And when a $35 module can outlive a $300 massage assembly, you can almost sense Tesla making a quiet statement. Comfort doesn't have to be expensive to be good. This philosophy continues the moment you close the door. In high-end cars, the last few millimeters of a soft close door require a dedicated motor assembly that adds weight and cost. Tesla takes an entirely different path. By combining dual-stage air gaskets with small alignment magnets hidden inside the frame, the Model 2 achieves the same soft, confident feel without motors, gears, or sensors. The sound is dampened, the ceiling pressure is smoother, and highway wind noise drops into a range normally found in vehicles well above this price bracket. What looks like a simple design tweak quietly improves long-term comfort, cabin quietness, and thermal control, while also keeping service costs at a level everyday drivers can actually afford. The ambient lighting system reinforces the trend. Instead of long LED strips glued across panels, Tesla routes a single optical fiber through the interior and feeds it with one RGB light source. The result 
is a clean line of evenly distributed light that feels surprisingly upscale. More importantly, it draws a tiny amount of power and avoids hot spots that fade interior materials. There's no visual grain, no mismatched hue between segments, and almost no maintenance. It is another example of Tesla upgrading the experience not by spending more, but by designing smarter. Even the windshield follows this logic. Rather than installing expensive acoustic glass, Tesla laminates a standard sheet with a damping film that neutralizes vibration before it can turn into cabin noise. This approach targets exactly the frequencies that cause fatigue on long drives and reduces them by up to 5 decibels. Because the film also reflects a portion of infrared heat, the cabin cools faster when parked in the sun. The adhesive layers age more slowly, and small cracks spread at a reduced rate, giving drivers time to repair rather than replace. Again, Tesla solves multiple real-world problems with a solution that costs a fraction of what traditional manufacturers would charge for a similar benefit. And as each of these systems flows naturally into the next, the overall picture becomes clearer. None of these upgrades Lighter roof, smarter seats, magnet-assisted doors, fiber-optic lighting, damped glazing, are dramatic on their own. But layered together, they form a chain reaction in the way the vehicle feels, sounds, and ages. Every gram removed, every watt saved, every vibration absorbed, quietly, shifts the experience upward into a category the price tag shouldn't be capable of reaching. That's where the real drama begins, not in flashy features, but in the compounding effect of disciplined engineering. A car that consumes less electricity under stress lasts longer. A cabin that cools quicker reduces battery strain in hot climates. Materials that resist heat and vibration maintain their appearance for years, and a structure that moves predictably with fewer corrections conserves energy over thousands of small moments. These are the kinds of efficiencies that don't show up on spec sheets, but reveal themselves over time. And they're exactly the reason so many people are asking whether Tesla is pushing towards something bigger than a single budget vehicle. With every new piece revealed, the conversation grows louder. Is Tesla democratizing premium engineering? or exposing how inefficient traditional automakers have been. Some argue it's a strategic pricing move to dominate global markets. Others believe Tesla is quietly building the blueprint for a future where premium doesn't depend on luxury materials, but on intelligent design. And as this thinking spreads, a new question emerges. One that feels less like speculation and more like a direct challenge to the industry. If Tesla can build a car for $10,955 that feels engineered like something four times the price, what does that mean for companies still relying on expensive parts to justify their margins? What happens when consumers begin to realize that premium comfort can come from physics, not price? And how much pressure will this put on competitors who haven't optimized weight, heat, airflow, or acoustic design with the same obsession? Every detail of the Model 2 reinforces the same message. This car wasn't built to be cheap. It was built to shift expectations of what a low-cost EV is allowed to feel like. And as more technical details surface, one thing becomes increasingly clear. Tesla isn't breaking physics. It's breaking habits the industry has relied on for decades. The takeaway is straightforward. The Model 2 proves that real innovation isn't always loud. Sometimes it's a thousand small engineering choices that add up to something far more powerful than the price tag suggests. And that's exactly why this moment matters. It signals a new phase where smarter design, not higher cost, drives the future of mobility. If advances like these continue, the entire EV landscape will shift faster than expected, opening the door to better materials, more efficient energy systems, 
and technologies that eventually support humanity's larger ambitions beyond Earth, this is just the beginning of that transition. Now I want to hear from you. How do you think this kind of engineering will influence the next generation of EVS and future space tech? Share your thoughts below. Your perspective drives the conversation forward. If you found value in this breakdown, make sure to like the video, comment your take, and subscribe to Tech Revolution. And if you want to stay ahead of every breakthrough, turn on notifications so you never miss what comes next. The future is already moving. Stay with us as it unfolds. Tesla's new $10,955 Model 2 isn't shocking because it's cheap. It's shocking because early data shows it feels engineered like a $40,000 car. A lighter roof that cuts heat, Doors that seal like luxury models, quiet glazing, smarter seats, and parts designed to slash lifetime cost. All of it points to one question. Did Tesla just redefine what premium means at the low end? Let's dive right in. Once you step past the headline price, the Model 2 starts revealing a deeper pattern that's impossible to ignore. Nothing on this car feels random. Every design choice hints at a quiet engineering strategy built around one goal, creating a low-cost vehicle that doesn't behave like a low-cost vehicle. And the first clue becomes obvious the moment you look up. Most buyers will see the polycarbonate light roof and assume Tesla cut corners, but a closer look shows the opposite. By replacing heavy panoramic glass, with a precisely formed polycarbonate sheet, Tesla removes up to 18 kilograms from the highest point of the car. That shift may sound trivial, yet it subtly changes how the Model 2 moves, turns, and consumes energy. A lighter upper structure lowers the center of gravity, stabilizing the body and reducing the constant torque corrections electric motors must make in city driving. The result is a quiet, steady gain in efficiency that compounds with every trip. And that alone raises a question. Is Tesla saving money or quietly improving the everyday physics of the car in places most people never think to check? Then there's heat. Polycarbonate mixed with proper UV and infrared coatings creates a roof that keeps the cabin up to 6 degrees cooler under harsh sun. A cooler cabin means less work for the air conditioning system, gentler battery drain, and 